Vlogs, welcome back to the channel. Doug with Stacking Investments here. Uh, we're still going old school with uh, episodes of what's in the box, a uh, new box, because my LCS gave me this uh, Maple Monster box because of my last purchase. So we're going to use it. Um, what do I want to do? Oh, um, I'm going to do a uh, bring attention to Pirate Stacker. Um, I will leave a link to his channel down in the description in case you haven't followed him. But I got something for Pirate Stacker. I'm gonna pull three. I'm gonna pull three boxes out for this video. But I got something. I think. Uh, I think uh, Pirate Stacker is gonna like. So I'm gonna offer him a trade deal. Now, full disclosure, I said <clears throat> because of a fiasco with a few bad apples in the YouTube community that I would never sell anything on the channel, but I did not say I wouldn't do trades. So as I come across something that I think a channel would like, I'm offering trades. I've offered uh, Silver Strike a couple things and I'm uh, just made offers and it's strictly trade only. I do not want monetary compensation. We're just, I'm offering what I have as a trade and it's up to the other channel if they want to accept it and do it. Um, if they don't, it's no big deal on me. Like my last one, I offered uh, Silverstruck some, a roll of uh, Barber Quarters that looked pretty good in exchange for some Benjis. Um, I have no, there's no ill will if um, my trade offers to other channels are declined no ill will i'll happily put the stuff in my stack or sell it at the flea market but i ran across this cool piece and i immediately thought of pirate stacker and uh i got it it's a cool box and what we have are five pirate rounds and i don't know if pirate stacker already has this or not um but this is the golden age of piracy one ounce silver proof five coin set. <laughs> it is serial, it's numbered 405 out of, where did they do that? The Perth Mint will release no more than 1500 of these sets. So this is set number 405. So Pirate, if you're interested, I have this set. Now I do not have, I don't know, I have no idea if there was an outer sleeve for this. I have no idea, but the box is pretty cool. And we'll go through the five coins, if I can get them out. This one is, it's like Captain Jacob. These are from 2009 Tuvalu. Queen Elizabeth, $1 denomination. They are proofs. <laughs> Let's see who this is. I... Oh, Captain Jack. Captain Jack. Cool rounds. Well, coins because it's a dollar denomination, so cool coin. And then we have this one. Captain Morgan, <laughs> or what? Hold on, I gotta break the book out. I can't see through the camera. <coughs> Who we got? Oh, come on. Don't do this to me. Let's see who we got. I can't read those things. Oh, Sir Henry Morgan. That's who that one is. Sir Henry Morgan. Again, 2009, two below. 
Mr. Henry Morgan. William Captain Kidd. <clears throat> so, very nice, nice round. Or coin. Then we have, what do we got here? Blackbeard. With a Blackbeard. I don't know if those are things on the capsule or what. But. Still pretty cool. And then the last one should be Black Bart. <sighs> oh, wait Black Bart. Who is... <clears throat> All right, come on. I can't be that tired. It's Black Beard. Oh, this is uh, Black Bart. Okay. Black Bart. Sorry, I'm tired. It's been a long day. Black Bart. So, uh, Pirate, if you're interested in this, I would trade you a $10 roll of walkers if you're interested if not no big deal either shoot me an email or leave a comment if not I'll uh, if you're not interested no problem this is actually a pretty cool set but thought I'd offer it up to you uh, since we're in the video Let's look at a couple more things. Marble, you can guess by the logo who this is. This was done in India. Come on. And their, C their COA says it was a limited edition, but nowhere in the COA does it say how many it was limited to? I'm sure there's a I'm sure there's a way to find out but they don't specify in the paperwork what it was limited to. Swiss excellence made in India. So, price was right on this. I'm going to flip this one at the market. And then I choose the future. 31.1 gram. Fine silver, four nines fine. So, pretty cool, pretty cool piece. So, something I'll have out at the market. I may just give it a couple. <clears throat> To get to my weekend market and my Wednesday market, and and uh, if I don't sell it, I'm gonna put that away for a present. Uh, and then another cool piece. This was 
limited to 500 pieces. The Icon Mint USA, it's a 2023 99 silver, basically a silver eagle. <laughs> but what they did to it was pretty cool. Oh, this one's numbered 422. I don't really have a I don't have a COA with it, but the coin is numbered 422. It's a 2023 Silver Eagle that has been modified, and then on the reverse, oh, on the reverse, that is pretty cool. You got the moon. What do they call this? The sun and moon silver eagle. <clears throat> so, pretty cool piece. Price was right on it, so. The coin does come out of that holder. the way they did it. Get a little foam backing, I guess, for when it's in the box. So keep it from falling out. But what do you think? Pretty cool. Like I said, the price was right. It's something I'll try to flip. I'm not big on the colorized coins, but you know, I figured this one was pretty cool. So anyways, let me know your thoughts. Let me know your thoughts down below. What do you think of the coins? Think of the Sun and Moon Eagle. What do you think about that one? 422 out of 500. What did you think of the Iron Man coin and Pirate? It's up to you, buddy. Just thought I'd throw that out there. So if you're interested, pirate, shoot me an email or leave a comment. And uh, I will see all of y'all on another video.